Restart. Shut down. Pick it up. Take it away. Very calmly. Put it down on the floor. Gently. Gently. Hello guys, welcome back to SimUK and welcome back to PC Building Simulator. It's Thursday, February 15th, 2018. We got two jobs in today. Catherine Dawes at Funky Dozer Hospital and Adrian Briscoe at actualbooks.uk. So, oh, that's an upgrade, look at that. Go to work, okie dokie Spokio. This one here, this Forster Helen, um, yes, we are, well, let's go look at the, ah, ooh, get past these PCs. We are expecting her um, graphics card to arrive on the 20th. So we're probably not going to get to do that today. But the other two we'll crack on with. So what have we got here? This one, Catherine Dawes, 3D Mark score of 3,767, which is a lot. 3D Mark score of 4,155, which is also a lot. So we're looking to do some sort of um, SLI crossfire type thing today. Possibly, possibly. Going to do some experimentos, I guess. So, let's take the side off, see what we've got here. GTX 980 Gamer, a Xi'an GeForce GTX 980 Gamer, and this one is a R9 380 Gaming 4G. Oh, hang on, isn't that what we need for... Isn't that... Oh, no, we're looking for a 280, aren't we? A 280, yes, we are, right. Okay, then, so let's install the necessary software. Whoa! I just, um... Uninstalled something. What the hell did I just take off then? That was unintentional. This? Goodness me. <laughs> well, that was exciting. Right, so that's going to install over there. This one we can turn on. Do you know what else we need in this game? The ability to have more than one USB stick. Or possibly set up our own server. And then we can connect this to the network and just pull the software we need off the, off the server rather than this archaic fashion that we're utilizing right now. That's what we need. Right, let's add 3D Mark here. Click here, extend the bar here, and then restart the PC here. Wonderful, absolutely splendid. Bravo. Right, let's take you out there. Come over here with the USB stick there and pop that little beauty. Come on now. Stick you in there like that and then we come over here. We click here. We click here twice. And then we come back over here and we run here and we run here so we know what our starting benchmark is. Then we come back in here and we restart here. Wonderful. It's all going so well this morning. I have to say, I'll tell you what. I have had the morning from hell today. My my little girl, she's nearly six. Um, some of you may know already, she has autism, which means that some days you just can't get her to do a damn thing that needs to be done. So I've been to hell and back today. It's been very, very stressful this morning. And, uh, yeah, I do feel sorry for her teachers some days because when she's in that kind of mood, it, it's, a, <laughs> it's a lot of work just to keep her on the straight and narrow, I tell you that much. Do I fear for the future? <laughs> oh, yes, I do. But uh, we'll focus on the present for now. Yes, this morning was a stressful morning, so I'm glad that this job is going so well so far. Now... In order to make sure that I do the right job here, I'm going to get a pen and a piece of paper, or a pencil and a piece of paper. Here we go, hang on. As if I planned it. <clears throat> okay, so we've got a score of 2,491. And we're running 
MSI Radeon. MSI Radeon R9380, R9380. Do you know, I just, I just wrote that, I've got to tell you, I don't know why I've got to tell you this. I just wrote down that eight. Um, I could possibly upgrade the GP, the CPU rather. Um, CPU is G4520. I mean, that's not, that's not a kick-ass CPU, so that would be a, Probably we're probably going to need to do something there. I would would have thought. Um, and what's the target here? The target is four thousand one hundred and fifty-five. Oh my! Oh my God! And that's for Adrian. Adrian wants a kick-ass PC. Let's see if we can do it. Okay, good. Um, yes, right. So I will finish that sentence. I wrote down my eight like I did when I was four, three, four, when I was learning how to write. Um, but I, I meant to do 380, but I wrote three zeros, so I ended up putting a zero on top of a zero and making an eight. That is not even close to being interesting, so let's move on. Uh, this one here, this is the next PC, and this one is has a target. Oh, I don't know what the target for this is, actually. Xi'an, GeForce, GTX. Let's write that down. Xi'an... GeForce GTX. What? Is she on GeForce GTX? What? What? What is it? What is it? i3 6100T. Now that's not that's not a bad processor. Uh, sixth sixth gen i3 processors are. I mean, sure, they're only two core, but they are pretty impressive in terms of performance. Um, quite possibly, quite possibly, could outperform an i5 of the fourth gen, let's say, for example. So they are pretty decent um, CPUs. Uh, so we'll probably get away with that, I would have thought. Um, let's just shut you down. Did I write the score down? No, I did not. That would have annoyed me. 3481. Also, there's no record of this, is there? Why can't we look back at the, at the records? Yeah, why can't we look at the records, man? We need, we need details and statistics that we can fall back on later. This game has to add so many things. Right, so that's a Xi'an GeForce GTX 980 Gamer. Damn, I just had to do my 80 the same way. My 8, I mean, the same way as I did just now. Oh, it's been one of those mornings. Coffee is not going to fix today, I tell you that much. Right, let's take this out just so... Uh, I can say that I've done it. Now, how do we do an SLI type scenario? I don't think I need to take that one out, but I'm going to take them all out just in case. In fact, what I should have done is look. <laughs> look at the motherboard so I know where I need to take one out, um, which I didn't do. So those first two I took out were totally pointless. Let's put a graphics card in here. What? No items in this category fit this case. Oh, because it's not SLI compatible. Oh, man. This is just going to get so expensive. Hmm. But, hmm. Is this one? They're all incompatible. This is a good card, this GeForce GTX 980 Gamer. That is a good card. I mean, it's far better than any of the cards we've got. Why can't I take this out now? What's the problem? Oh, this bloody cable's attached itself. I do think the cable should only attach when I hit the power button. It is a bit of a frustration, I have to say. Right, okay, let's go look at the statistics we've got over here then. So, graphics cards, GTX 980 Gamer. I mean, look at that. That is that is set, that is currently ranked 7th best card. That is a good card. Right? So, the Xi'an GTX 980 gives us a score of 2654. 
And the i3-6100, let's go look at what more. 6100, Intel iCore 6100T. Oh, the T is actually slower. It's interesting. 782. So if I do some quick calculations here, we can see that the score we get is 3,436. So that's fairly close to our um, 3G mark score of 3,481. And I'm guessing the extra uh, little bit there, the extra 40 odd, is just from the RAM. Um, but the, we don't have any statistics for RAM, so I can't check what difference that will make. So, um, and our target for this... I've forgotten to write the target down. Yeah, damn fool! 3,767. That's not too outlandish, is it? It's 3,767. So we're running a deficit of... Two hundred and eighty-six. Okay, two hundred and eighty-six. So um, we need to get. Is there a cut? Mm, this is the question, isn't it? We can certainly boost that with a CPU. I three. Um, that's probably the most cost-effective way to do it. I think graphics cards are probably more expensive than CPUs. I don't know, but seeing as we are running such a good graphics card already. To boost that by 200, what was the thing? 286. We have to be 2,900 and 40. 2,940. Which is an MSI GeForce GTX 980 Ti Gaming 6G LE. So, let's have a look and see how much that is. Oops. So that's this one here. So that's $435, which is very expensive. So let's go look at the cards, uh, the CPUs instead, and see if that's a more cost-effective approach. So the i3-6100T, we need a boosting score of 286, so we're looking at 9... 1,000 and... 1068, which is going to be just above this iCore 6400. So the AMD Ryzen 3 Quad Core 1300X is not going to fit, but an i5-6500 will. Do we have an i5-6500 already? Not anymore. I think we used to have one, didn't we? That's annoying. I can't see the price. 200 quid. Okay. So that That is um, a damn sight cheaper, and I think that's going to get us the score we need. So that's that's an experiment right there, isn't it? So, okay, we've experimented on the first one. So we're going to go for an i5 6400 at $200. That's $235 cheaper than the graphics card. So that would be that would be an interesting experiment to see if that works for that machine. Let's do a similar thing over here. What's this one? This is obviously a lot more. Now this does have SLI. So um, and I think we're getting like four hundred dollars for this one. So we could just get a second card, but let's 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 do it um, systematically. So that's our target score of 4,155, and we're currently running 2,491, which gives us quite a big deficit, actually, this time round. It's going to be much harder. We're running a deficit of 1,664. A deficit of 1,664, um, yeah. That's huge. That is huge. And what's the CPU in here? A G4520. I think that's going to be our step forward, a G4520. So let's have a look, see here. At CPUs. So yeah, that Intel Pentium G4520 
633 that's got a score of. So we're going to need uh, 1,663, I think. Now, is there... Yes, there is. The Intel iCore i7-6700K. i7-6700K. That will give us a score of... 1,691 but I suspect rather horrifically that's going to re require a new motherboard so let's just have a look here i7 6700k uh, that's the Skylake obviously the other one isn't going to be what was it G4 520 that's a Skylake So it will fit. It's very expensive though. We're not going to get a good profit out of that. We're not going to get a good profit out of that at all. What graphics card does she have? Oh, 9380. So that's a lot cheaper. That's 215. R9 380. Is she running the 2 gig? Oh, look, they're the same price. Well, then we'd have to get this one, wouldn't we? Okay, so we're going to try doing an MSI Rally on R9 380 4G uh, in SLI configuration, and we're going to try installing an i5 6400. So, we'll do next day delivery because I'm a cheap sod. And uh, we'll hit buy now. Oh, goodness me. Think happy thoughts. Think positive, boys and girls. Let's see how we get on. Let's end the day. And then go to work. Here's our stuff. Excellente. Excellente. Absolutely brilliant day. And in here. What are we going to install in here? I cannot for the life of me remember. Which one is... Ah, this is the potential SLI thing that we're going to do. So, we're going to need to take this out. And this out. And then, uh, graphics card. What the heck? It's got the cap there for the, um, for the crossfire. It's exactly the same card. Hmm... Hmm. Well, the only thing I can think is that the motherboard itself is not compatible. It's not capable of uh, running dual, dual uh, graphics cards. A, no a Mortoni Z170. Oh, God, let's go look. Mortoni Z170 M Tech. Budget motherboard with all the features you would expect for your money. The perfect range for any first time hardware buyer who wants to experiment without breaking the bank. Yeah. <clears throat> we need something. Um... So we need. Ah. Damn. That's KB Lake, that's AM4, that's AM4. You are kidding me. Damn and blast. I really should have checked that first, shouldn't I? Ah. Nougats. Oh no, wait. Hang on a minute. Hang on one minute. What the hell am I doing here? What the hell am I doing here? So this one, I've ordered a dual... Um, two graphics cards. Ah, oh, damn it! Damn it, damn it, damn it. Damn it, damn it to hell. So this one, we're replacing the CPU, huh?
God damn it. So we can't do SLI today. It's not available to us. Ah, this is why I hate this ranking system. It's so unnecessarily restrictive. You wouldn't start a PC business if they said to you, oh yeah, you can start a PC business, but we're only going to sell you the very basic of components. You'd be like, what? I want the bits I want. I don't want the bits you want to sell me. Stupid. Stupidness. The stupidness of it all. Why is that unplugged? Did I take that card out? I must have done. Right. So we have a new CPU in there with thermal paste, no less. Let's run this damn thing and see just, oh man, I've completely balls this one up. So we can't do what I was going to do. So we're going to have to think of something else for this one. Who's this? This is Catherine Dawes. So that, she's got the nice GTX 980 and she's running an i3 6100T. And we, ne we only need to boost by 286, so... Oh, flipping live! It's a CPU upgrade for this one as well. What's she running? An i3 6100T. Let's have a look here. i3 6100T. No, wait, 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 wait! Wait, 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 wait. I bought the processor for her. I, did I not say today's been a very, very difficult day? <laughs> God damn it! Right, okay. We're, we're going to see what score we get here. Because we can't do the... Um, yeah, this is the one I was going to put dual uh, graphics cards in. And we can't because we don't currently have access to a motherboard that will allow us to do that. And this needs a huge performance increase. So what CPU is he running? He's running a G4 520. So, I mean, yeah, to be honest, the CPU upgrade might, might actually do the job. 2684. So that's a small increase, but not a lot. God damn it. God damn it. I need, to, I need to concentrate more. Give me that flipping CPU, you. Right. This is the test we're actually meant to be doing over here. No, it's not. Oh, is it? I, compl I don't know where the hell I am right now. I, I also have someone here looking after me, I think. That's how I feel right now going so well this morning. I just want to stick my head in an oven, turn it on, bake myself for about six hours, come back. Come back? I'll still be there, won't I? Oh, well, I'll come back to the game with a, with a baked head and just see if that makes things any better. Let's be honest, there can't be any flipping worse, can they? I don't know what I'm doing. I'm absolutely all over the place right now. Um, I think I did something wrong. What did I do wrong? Why aren't you booting up? All the cables are in. I think that's the right fan. i5, 6400. 1151 Skylake. DDR4, yeah. I have no idea which, which, which one went in here, I'll be honest. Oh, there's no graphics card. <laughs> she have in here? She had a GTX 980 gaming gamer. Gamer, that's what she had. Right. My goodness me. 
The inability to think in straight lines is really starting to wind me up. I have no idea if that's going to work now. I wrote all this down. I didn't write it down very neatly, I'll be honest. I could have done a better job with my layout. But, um, yeah, I mean, I should. I should have got something right. <laughs> An i5-6400. Yeah, so that was paid $200 for this PC to give us a 286 score boost. And in the other PC, uh, we went for a R9 380 for $215. But what we should have gone for is an i7 6700K so that we could upgrade the CPU and not um, not the graphics card because we don't have any um, SLI compatible motherboards. That's, that's, what, that's what went wrong. That's what the problem was with this one. Gosh darn it. What did we order delivery of MSI Radeon? Yeah, what was it? An MSI Radeon? Damn it, what did I order? Why isn't there a history here? That is so annoying. <laughs> 3D Mark score of 2154. So we've ordered a graphics card for that. But I don't know which one it is. So I can't swapping out for the one that I've just bought by accident. <sighs> right, what's the target here? 3767, and we've missed it. 3621. It's not been a good day. <laughs> uh, it's not been a good day. Let me see here, what can we do? 3621 we got off that. Whereas the i5-6400 should have given us damn it that's not enough is it bam bloody tastic fan bloody tastics but we should only be 10 shy of our mark and we're more like 40 shy oh this has been an absolute shambles so tired I just need some sleep just need some sleep, guys. That's all I bloody need. And maybe a daughter who does... Oh, man, I'll tell you what. This morning, she was disrespectful. She was um, she was disassembling things. She was um, dishonest. She was just dissing me all bloody morning. It was an absolute nightmare. I, I was so happy when we finally got to school. And I could hand her over to the teachers. But then I had to say to them, listen... Expect the worst today because we have had a morning. We have had one hell of a morning. Oh. Right, so what I've done, guys, is I've jammed a whole bunch of RAM. I've jammed the RAM. I have jammed the RAM. And what are we going to do about this one? Well, this one, I'm guessing we need that i7, really, don't we? And if this one doesn't get a high enough score, we're going to have to get another CPU for this as well. I could bake my face right now, I tell you that much. Bake my face. I should have had a, a, instead of having a coffee this morning, I should have had an Irish whiskey. A large Irish whiskey without the coffee. That's what I should have had. Let's just go back to bed, I think. Go back to bed and get up next next week sometime. 3836. So we've done it. We've, we've, we've achieved the target. In fact, we've exceeded the target. So... Let's take out two of these and just see if that's going to do, do the do. Whoa, 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 whoa. Concentrate. Oh, goodness me. Well, the, the idea, the premise was good. I just ordered the wrong CPU by accident. And um, for the other one, I tried to do SLI. And we don't have any SLI compatible motherboards at the moment. So, I mean, I did 
completely balls it up. But we kind of got there on this one at least. So we can get rid of one of them. And how many days have we got to wait? So we've got another three days before um, before this one out here is going to have its parts done up. And it's so annoying that there's no history of purchasing. So I, I can't. I genuinely can't. I mean, I could go back and watch my video, but I can't do that whilst I'm making a video um, to see what card I, I ordered. So we're kind of screwed on that front. If this doesn't hit the, the target, I'm just going to stick another RAM stick in there and then just chuck it out the bloody window. Stick it at the door, is what I meant to say. Um, yeah. <laughs> Flipping hell. Flipping hell. Flipping hell. Oh, man. I'm not, I'm not going to make this mistake again. Um, it's just been a bad day. <laughs> 3,705. What's the target? 3,767. Right. God damn it. God damn you. So what's this? A 4 gig stick. And that's... Oh, that's only a 2 gig. Oh, why didn't I look at that? Why didn't I look and see that she was only running 2 gig of RAM? I mean, for goodness sakes. Right. She's running 8 gig on a single channel. That's not what I normally do, but do you know what? For fear of actually throwing the PC out the window, and I'm talking about my PC now, we're just going to run with that and hope that that gets the score. I think that'll get the score. Uh, an upgrade, 8 gig RAM upgrade, CPU upgrade, I think. You stupid mofo! <laughs> I just right-clicked on it. I haven't done that for ages. I do hate that. I do, oh my god, I need to go back to bed, guys. What the monkey? Put the side on. Run the thing. Walk away, walk away. Right, what are we going to do with you? An i7, we've calculated, should sit in there and work properly and give you the performance boost that you need. Now, just to be smart or proactive, let's stick a stick, let's stick a stick. Let's stick a stick of RAM in here as well. And uh, let's just order the damn parts. Let's do it now. Let's waste our money, I don't care. I've had enough today. Buy. Now oh, look, your items have arrived for $100. $100 to have it delivered the same day. Are you mental? It's quite a lot. I think it's quite a lot, to be honest. Uh, i7, 6700K. Very nice. Very, very nice uh, CPU, that. Very nice indeed. I wouldn't mind swapping my CPU for that. What? Oh! Oh, that's cool. I've just spotted, if you don't put the, uh, the shield down, you can't install the the fan over the top of it. So that's another bug fix. It's not a bug fix so much, it's just um, a logic fix that they've added. Which is good! This game just keeps getting better. Which is wonderful. I wish I was the same. I wish I just kept getting better as well. I feel like I'm getting worse every day, to be honest with you. Right, let's look at you. 3753. <laughs> what?! 3753, I mean, that is so damn close. All right, take the side off. Stick a stupid bit of memory back in there. In fact, you can have them both. Do you know what? You can have them both, lady. Because I'm sick to death of your PC, this RAM, and the whole process today. So, because I'm in such a bad mood, you get an extra stick of RAM. How's that for good, huh? Even when I've had enough, I still give the very best I can give. And it's also to make up for the fact that I put the wrong processor in there. What the monkey? A problem has been detected and an Omega system has been shut down to prevent damage to your computer. The system encountered an uncorrectable hardware error. If this is the first time you've seen this ever error, restart your computer. If this screen appears again, follow these steps. Check to make sure any new hardware or software is properly installed. If this is a new installation, ask your hardware or software manufacturer. Do you know what I think happened there? Do you know what I think happened there? Is the CPU paste that I put on disappeared when I shut the shield. 
and there's a word that you can oh, there's a sentence you can easily get wrong so let's test this out so I put some paste on there and then I close the shield and that doesn't break the problem huh. I don't know I don't know you guys tell me let me know in the comments where I ballsed up on that one because I clearly did right installer though Everything else installed? Looks to be that way. Good. Nearly right click on that. Nearly right click, right clicked on that. Now hang on. It did start running, didn't it? It did start running at first. The RAM looks okay. I wonder if they've added random bugs, like random issues. 3.8. Yeah, we've done it. We've done it. Do you know? <laughs> just take, just take it away, please. Remove. How many times do I have to click on you? Restart. Shut down. Pick it up. Take it away very calmly. Put it down on the floor gently. Get down, sir! That done. Uh, we can now get rid of this. Sorry if I made you jump there, guys. <laughs> ah, that is a beautiful loss. Do you work with computers? I do, but I really shouldn't. Can you repair something for me? I'll try, but I probably can't. Who makes RAM that fragile anyway? I'm going to need it by four days at the latest, Vince. What do you need? Replace RAM. $255. Yeah, absolutely. We'll take that job on, because that is easy. What is going on here? I've not seen this before. This is like a random error. Which didn't exist before. Crikey. Do you know what? I think we're going to have to leave this one and come back to it. We're going to have to leave this one and come back to it, because this, this episode has taken so long, and it's basically sucked every ounce of energy out of my body. <laughs> I am so unbelievably exhausted right now that I just, I cannot, I, I don't think I can look at this um, analytically, in, in, in enough of an analytical manner to be able to solve it. I think my, my brain is just fried beyond belief. Let's just look at the inventory a minute. It's not saying that there's an error with this at all. No, it's blue screened again. Blue screened again. Okay, fine, fine, absolutely bloody fine. I will see you next time. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Um, clearly, we got a bit of a bit of a rogue on our hands with this one, so uh, I'm going to have to spend a bit of time figuring that out. Maybe take that i7 back out and just make sure that everything is as it should be. So please do join me for the next episode, where hopefully my brain will be marginally less fried, and um, we'll do a better job. Until then, take care. Goodbye for now.